crime of passion. This one's yours, Paige. You're the only one who could solve it. A bullet it. in the head. The killer's looking for an answer, but he's looking for it in the wrong place. He should be looking for it in his own head. The suspect is ready for a lineup. You should hurry, Paige, or you'll miss him. Oh. His heart broke. Damn it, we're losing him. Give him hope. Six milligrams. Charge. Clear. Clear. Nothing. Go again. 300. 300. Charge. Clear. Clear. Nothing. Doctor, again, once more. 350. Charge. Clear. Clear. Still nothing. Lost him. Time of death, 2.30 a.m. NYPD, drop the gun. What are you gonna do about it, pal? We're all guilty of something if you look hard enough. Time to 
wake up. That won't help a thing. The bullet in my head brought me to you. Max, come on. Time to wake up. She was beautiful. I hated her for making me feel this way. Now that I was with her, I was reluctant to hear her answers. You okay? Vlad was headed to Woden's Manor. <sighs> don't be stupid. You're not in shape to go anywhere. You'll die. I don't care. This isn't your fight, Max. You can walk away. I'm asking you. I didn't deserve to walk away. There are no happy endings. You're coming with me. It was too late. I couldn't trust her. Not before I had seen this through. Vlad was right. There are no choices. Nothing but a straight line. The illusion comes afterwards. When you ask why me and what if. When you look back, see the branches. Like a pruned bonsai tree. Or a forked lightning. If you had done something differently, it wouldn't be you. It would be someone else looking back, asking a different set of questions. Showtime. I'll go down first. Cover me from here. There! Alert! They're here! Damn! Max, I'm going in. Damn. I'll climb down. No, stay there. I'll take the first floor, you take the second. Okay. I'm not sure I can... Incoming!
season finale of Lords and Ladies, brought to you in part by Cleansing Cleaning Products. I fled into the night. Behind me, in the dark, Here goes. the manor house burned like near a row. My Lord Valentine. Cover me! The meaning of being a lady took me out to the world. The garden of my childhood home. Deeper into the building, look for Woden or Vlad. All right. Check the other wing. Right. Of all my friends, I wouldn't have it any other way. I'm so glad we are together in this. Yes, sir. Woden and the gold are in the panic room. All we need to do is get in. There is no rush. It's not like they are going anywhere. The explosives are in place, sir. We are going to make a beautiful exit. Woden's bodyguards had betrayed him and joined Vlad. There was still time. They hadn't gotten to him yet. The panic room was at the back of the manor. Sacks and Payne, they're already inside. They're extremely dangerous. We need to stop them before... Mona was still on the case. Turn to C. 
Ascender Marathon, the last episode of Address Unknown ever. The poet Pool in his poem, Somebody's Been Wearing My Face Again, wrote, In this hall of mirrors built by liars, I am a pale reflection of myself. I had escaped from the Pinkberg Mental Institute. I was lost in Noir, York City. I couldn't find my way back home. John Mira had made me a killer. I had become him, John Mira. Maybe I had always been him. John Mira? Yes, this is he. This is John Mira. Welcome to the next level. <laughs> Odin's in his panic room at the back of the manor. It's up ahead, see you there! Here, let me. This way. Woden knew the manor. She was working for Woden. Vlad had told me the truth. Mona, wait. Stop. This is love. When someone drags you from the wreckage when you have given in, ready to just lie there and die. I told you not to come here. It's my job to clear up this mess and you're a part of it. Throw away your guns. This is love. When someone, no matter what the cost, shows you there is hope, a choice, that you can put down your gun. See? I can't do it. You're a bastard, Max. This is love. Love hurts.
I was so looking forward to you two killing each other. Ah, oh, you can't have everything. I had been here before. Ground Zero. You are making me look incompetent by refusing to die. Stop. I am sorry. Enough! A bomb went off in my head. The bullet lodged in my brain moved to fatal, microscopic distance. The killing has gone too far. I have only begun. It's better to reign in hell than serve in heaven. You flatter yourself. Demented fool! I felt the rise of that old familiar feeling. I hated it. I welcomed it. Everything was clear again. No more ambiguities, no more questions. No gun when you need one. <coughs> one last thing left to do. I was compelled to give Vlad his gun back. One bullet at a time. He's behind me! Hold him off! And give me a gun! We can still kiss and make up, Max. It's good Take that the women are set off the, the bombs. Way. They only the panic room. To the matters. panic room. They're gonna blow. Dibbing, of course. even a little. Face it, you might as well be dead already. Do yourself a favor, give up! Hey! of violence throughout the city. Allegedly tied to the Valkyr scandal of 2001, these acts are thought to be part of the criminal underworld's vendetta against the New York City Police Department. 
Lieutenant Jim Bravora, who was leading the investigation, became a victim of a shooting earlier tonight. He remains in hospital care and is said to be in stable condition. The NYPD has been placed on full alert, and according to our source, the guilty will be, quote, found and brought to justice, unquote. For NYNN TV News, this is Kira Silver. You have two new messages. Alfred, I told you this was a bad idea. I can understand your remorse, but this isn't helping Max. It's only making it worse. I'm not sure I can do this. I told you we had a history. I'm... I... Hell, I'm mad about this guy. I'm just not sure I can go through with this. You have one new message. I'm coming to kill you, old man. You really know how to piss me off, you know? Would it have killed you to say thank you for once in your life? To say, Vlad, my son. Can I call you my son? Because I sure do love you like one. Vlad, my son. You are a true prodigy. Everything you touch turns to gold. Oh, wait. It is going to kill you. I'm done doing your dirty work for you. You should be proud. I have learned all you've taught me. I'm coming to show you. You have no new messages. You should be glad, Max. I did you a favor, finished off your revenge for you. The murderer of your loved ones is dead. You have wrecked my restaurant twice now. You can be so damn uncompromising, fanatical about these things, Max. One of these days, it's going to get you killed. Forgotten you. Everything all right down there? Did you know that the old map? Ooh, is this the way you want to play it?
me that man. <laughs> that was <coughs> Max, dearest of all my friends. I was supposed to be the hero. chances to turn around and face it, but it's like kissing the lips of your dead love, darkness waiting in the hole of your mouth. It was almost morning, waking up from the American dream. We are willing to suffer to die for the things we care about, for love, for the right choices. Because of her, I had solved the case, my case, all of it, who I am. Is it worth it? Saying that it never is would be a lie. Sometimes you get lucky. Sometimes something good comes out of it, something you know you wouldn't deserve in a million years. Uh. turned out to be such a damsel in distress. Something that gives you a reason to go on. NYPD, freeze! Easy! Don't move! We need a paramedic team here. We have two survivors. I had a dream of my wife. She was dead. But it was all right. <laughs> 